Hey guys, it's Morgan from the Beach Classroom. Today I'm going to be doing a video on capsule wardrobe. So just kind of like a Q&A and just some pros and cons of um, my experience with capsule wardrobe so far. So um, I had asked on Instagram, <clears throat> if you don't follow me, it's the Beach Classroom. And um, so I just took some questions from there. And then also I just like made some pros and cons that I thought myself. So you're probably wondering what is a capsule wardrobe. Um, that was like a lot of people ask me that since I've been doing it. And I'm just kind of like when I start something it is full floors. Like I'm out tell everybody <laughs> that I'm doing it. So a capsule wardrobe is basically just like a closet or like your dresser or whatever. It's just your wardrobe and um, it's filled with pieces that you love. Like... If you're a leggings and a t-shirt kind of girl, like, you have leggings and t-shirts. And, of course, you have, like, a few different pieces um, for other things, but um, I'll get into that in a little bit. However, it's, like, stuff that you love wearing, um, and it's not just, like, a cluttered closet of a bunch of stuff. Um, there's, like, actually not as many clothes. Um, if you, like, watch some videos, which I thought was funny because, um, so... I'll tell you why I got started on this in a second, but um, when I was looking for videos about like kind of just what is it, um, it was all people like in Europe, um, which I thought was funny. There, like there was really no like American videos of this, so I just thought that was kind of neat. And um, it's more of like a minimalist lifestyle, so yeah, here we go. So basically someone said, why am I doing this? So, um, basically, I, like, love purging. I hate clutter. Um, and then, like, I went through a breakup, and I just kind of was like, I need to get rid of everything. Um, and so I, like, when I was in Florida last, I found this girl, Cotton Stem, on Instagram. And I just happened to see that she, like, does capsule wardrobe and her highlights. And, like, I didn't know what that was, so I clicked on it, and she, like, kind of gave a brief, like, tutorial of like how to do that or something so I like was purging my kitchen and watching it once I got home and I marched upstairs it was literally like the Sunday before going back to school like on break and I just started like purging everything and um like once I like purged a bunch of the clothes I had to go back in and do way more so um I'm gonna put my like purging video up next um, so stay tuned for that, but, um, I'll talk more about what I did in that video, in the video. <laughs> okay, so, um, I also noticed that, like, uh, I love wearing the same, like, tank, or, like, say, like, it's this shirt or whatever, like, I want to wear it a lot if I love it, and it's like, why do I have all these other clothes when I love this shirt or whatever, and, um, I feel like I'm answering like other questions when I'm talking right now, but someone had asked, um, so why am I doing this? It's because I literally like wanted to purge stuff and like once I did, it felt so good. Um, that's like the main reason why. Then the second question or another question is, um, is it weird picking out repeat outfits? So that's kind of what I was getting to and um, no, it's not and like honestly, I'm a pretty confident person, like, I just am naturally. I'm, like, shy, but I'm confident in what I'm doing. So, if someone's like, oh, you wore that yesterday, I'm like, yeah, I don't care. <laughs> so, um, I don't, like, usually wear, like, the exact same clothes because I, like, sweat a lot. So, like, I would never be able to wear this tomorrow because it needs to be washed. But, um, it's, like, the same style outfit a lot of times or, like, um, like in the summer, I have this green tank top and I literally like, I wore it so many times. Like my ex was always like, didn't you wear that like on the last date night? And I was like, oh yeah, like I literally like, cause I just felt good in it. And it was like something I liked the way I looked. So when I heard about this, I'm like, oh, this is so for me, but it's not weird to me picking out repeat outfits. And last year I bought this rainbow, um, cardigan on Amazon and I decided to wear it every Tuesday with like just like a t-shirt and leggings and it was so nice because every Tuesday I was like mm, I'm wearing my rainbow um cardigan and so I've been kind of doing that like this week I wore this like dressier top so I think I'm gonna like wear like dressy tops 
this week but we'll see and then every wednesday like i'll wear this same kindness shirt and it's like super easy once you get going with it because you do get rid of a lot of stuff and i did like sell a bunch of my stuff to like local people on facebook um but then i like just donated the rest to my dance girls and my cousins and um like honestly it just feels so good to start over and start fresh and then when you like go shopping you don't like like uh i don't know if they'd be called like bin shopping like you don't just like, buy a bunch of random stuff you like kind of look at the stuff and you're like oh does this go with my style like do i like the way these kind of shirts fit like is this my like capsule wardrobe so um it's been nice because on wednesdays we have like kindness day so i went out and like i got like a kindness shirt that i knew i would like and then um like, I've worn it every Wednesday for the past, like, four weeks or three weeks or something like that. So, that's worked out really well. I don't want to make this video too long, so I'm going to keep <laughs> answering some of the questions. Um, how do you change for seasons? So, like, obviously, I just started, but, um, like, I left, like, all my dresses in my closet. I did purge some, but once, like, that season comes back of wearing dresses to school, like, I'll like, notice which ones I'm not wearing as much, and then I'll get rid of some of those. Um, but basically, like... You, like, I keep, like, all my jeans, like, I keep all my, like, I wear a lot of, like, pants and a top, or leggings and, like, a longer shirt, or jeans and a top, like, that's just my look, or, like, yoga pants and a sweatshirt, so I have, like, a lot of that, um, but I don't have, like, too much, like, I can be, like, oh, today I want to wear my, like, black hoodie with my camel pants, and I can picture it, um, it says, what does your closet look like? Um, basically, just what I've explained, like, um, outfits I love. Um, I have it in, like, rainbow, <laughs> like, color coordinating. I have my dresses, and then I have, and I have, like, a video of what my closet looks like, and it's coming up. Um, and then I have, like, my sweatshirts and stuff on the other side. Um, is it, or no, I already answered that. Um, oh, where do I buy a majority of my capsule wardrobe? Um... So basically I shop at Target and Forever 21, um, those are like my two main things. I like getting pieces on like Amazon or random stuff, but like I'm trying to just stay to my, uh, my capsule wardrobe. <laughs> so like I have this top from Hollister that I love, so like it was on sale for $7, so I like bought a few more because I'm like I love wearing this, I know I like feel good in it, and that's like the whole thing, like you just feel good in your clothes. Um, so I'm going to just go to my pros and cons because I really don't want this video to be long. But um, the pros is the laundry. So like I feel more motivated to do my laundry because um, I don't have that many clothes that I want to wear anymore. And before I would just be like, oh, I'll just like wear all this other stuff um, and like let my laundry pile up. And now it's like, okay, like I'll wear like kind of whites like a few days and then like I'll wear, like, and I'll throw those in the wash and I'll wear, like, blacks a few days. Um, because I don't throw my clothes together, so that's, like, really helpful for me. And, um, like, for dance, like, I'll wear the same yoga pants, like, two days in a row because I'm, like, who cares? And then, like, um, I'll just change, like, the shirt I'm wearing underneath and, like, I might just, like, wear the same sweatshirt because it doesn't matter. Um, and, like, so it just, like, has made laundry so much easier. Um, before, it's, like, I had all my socks, and I washed my black socks separate from my colored socks, from my underwear, from my, like, colored clothes and white clothes and black clothes. Um, so, like, sometimes laundry, like, takes forever, but with this, I feel like it's shortened. Um, and now it's just, like, clothes, like, smaller loads, and then, like, my socks and stuff like that so it's really helped laundry and I feel really good about that because I haven't left clothes in the dryer and that is something that I was working on this year um another pro is it makes morning so easy like the night before I kind of know what I want to wear usually um and then I just put it on but sometimes like I might change but it's similar where before like I used to be late for work all the time because I would try on my outfit and I'd hate it and then I'd try on something different and something different and like and then the clothes would just be piled on my bed and it was just awful and then by the end of the week because I'm like so busy um I have all these clothes like just in my closet and then I have to spend all this time putting it away so um when like there's more minimal like clothes you're more eager to like put the shirt back on the hanger or like you're not really trying on a bunch of stuff because it's all kind of similar and you know you like everything. Um, 
the comfort is awesome like and feeling refreshed like I just feel like good that I got rid of so much stuff and I just want to keep purging my house and also like um, just like knowing I love my outfits is awesome and like it makes me feel so much better at work it like makes getting up in the morning like more motivating so I really like that um I wrote two cons down um one was getting rid of memories so like I'm pretty um can't think of the word for it I have no idea uh why can't I think of the word I don't know anyways like where you um like feel bad getting rid of something because it holds like a memory so what I did was like I really tried like if I've never worn this in five years like come on it's got to go because I had most of those like things kind of put to the side anyway so I did go through the boxes that I had that like I was just, like saving for no reason um and like I saved like a couple of things like my Kobe Bryant jersey um I saved like a LeBron shirt from Cleveland um like I bought Michael Jackson shirts when he had passed away, so I, I saved one. I had like three, um, so I like kind of went through it. But um, it feels good to just like get rid of stuff. So I know, like, like my cousin had bought me a shirt and he passed away, and like I would never get rid of that shirt because he bought it for me. But I like never wear it. But I just want to hold on to it. So there's some things that I get like you have to hold on to. But then like some of the stuff, like I had every Scribe shirt. I used to work at this daycare called Scribes, and I loved it. I had every single one, like every color. I'm like, why do I have all these? So I saved one just like for memories, but the rest I just got rid of. Um, and then um, a con maybe would be possibly not having a specific like item. So for example, if it's like um, a spirit day or something at your school, like, well, most people watching this are teachers, but whatever, like the case is, it's like a spirit day and you're like, oh, I got rid of my baseball shirt or whatever um I found that like just like wearing the outfit that you like like maybe like the white tee and the jeans or whatever and then just pairing it with like a headband or um maybe of a sweatshirt of that or something like that to go with it um because I used to hold on to stuff like that like oh I'll wear this on Valentine's Day next year and then I never do so I'm like I'm not doing that anymore if I really really want something then I will get guess get it but right now I'm just trying to like s stick to simple and um this is coming from a girl who in high school I never wore a repeat outfit like I always try to wear a different outfit like it was just like a goal of mine it wasn't to be like oh I have all these different outfits it was just like I always wanted to have a different outfit just for myself like I just thought it was fun um and now I'm just like I'm not doing that but I feel like what everything I wore back then like I liked to but now it's just like that's too crazy and too clutter and too much for me so um if you're thinking about doing it like you can always message me on Instagram or comment below and like I can answer your questions but um I'm just new to this and I'm just a beginner too so that's all I have for you all right thanks for watching bye